you can access all functions in the bar on the right side of the run screen. All buttons have two functions click once or press and hold to perform different actions. For the top button, when you click on it once, you enter into the job types menu. Everything here has something to do with height and design. You can operate without GPS, select a design file, create a surface design, operate according to a slope or set the height according to a point or line. You also have the option to choose background file or find your history from previous jobs. If you hold it down, you enter the cloud projects and local projects. You can also create your own project. You press new project, type in a name, select if it should be synced with the cloud. Select the coordinate system and GeoID. The next button is the offset menu. If you press it once, you can adjust the height offset. You can indicate your offset in numbers or you can adjust it up and down manually. You can switch via this button if the offset should be positive instead of negative or vice versa. You can also adjust the side offset by pressing side offset. You can adjust it up and down manually. You can also use a GPS offset. Insert the elevation of the fixed point and press set GPS offset. The difference is indicated in the top right corner. You can remove the GPS offset again here. If you press and hold this button, it will reset your offset to zero for the current position of the bucket. Go to the offset menu to remove offset. The third button is to adjust the focus point. Press it once to switch the focus point. If you zoom in you can see how the focus changes from right to left to center. With the fourth button, you can change the bucket. Press it once to change the bucket to the next on the list. If you press and hold it down, select the bucket you need from a list. You can also copy or create a new bucket. You can go to calibration to adjust the calibration. Or remove a bucket from the list by pressing delete. 